So this young girl presents with a rash, and I'm not going to show her face, and Dad knows my videos end up on YouTube, but uh, she really turned out to be a good teaching situation for us as far as the uh, carpetoid lesions. It's got a little bit on her hands and and on her arms. Yeah, let's go up to up on her arms here. So this, but these all these all started after after she had finished taking some antibiotics. What was the antibiotic? She was taking the Omnicef. Omnicef. All right. So it was a cephalosporin antibiotic. And Dad, you've also recognized that she's had what any swelling in her joints or just general swelling around the lesion there. Around the lesions, but she's been holding her knees like her knees hurt, like she's had some joint pain. Yes. She did, okay. So when you when you really look at targetoid lesions in kids, you have to think about three different things. You have to think about urticaria multiforme, also known as giant urticaria, erythema multiforme. She has no mouth lesions, no oral lesions. Uh, no problems with her eyes. Um, but then the third thing you have to think about is serum sickness. So three targetoid lesions in kids. I think she fits into the serum sickness type of picture with the arthralgias. And she's getting treated with some uh, steroid. Um, and then I'm doing a combination of a first and second generation H1 blocker and um, an H2 blocker. Uh, so uh, hopefully she'll be getting better. She's had a how many doctor visits has she had now? Uh, this is bank about number five. Number five, yeah. See all this?